to the wind up here to go. Oh my god. That's a nice rockfish there. I'm pretty sure that's a nice rockfish. Hey everybody, I'm Chris and this is my channel Chesapeake Chris. Thanks for stopping by. Okay, it's about 7.30 in the morning. It's about 58 degrees out here, 62 degree water. I think it's gonna be high tide right about now. Sun's coming up, water's not too bad. There's not much of a breeze. So we're gonna start off with the chicken foot chatterbait and the jointed minnow. Then we're gonna come out here and see if we can catch some rockfish. It is rocked over, so. There's one, there's, oh. I swear to God, I don't know how those fish get missed. That's that Z-Man. I don't know how he got missed. That almost makes me want to troll back through there. He was a, it was a pretty good strike. I just do not understand how I don't end up with a hooked fish when that happens. I really don't. There's a fish that looks like a perch. And it's... I can't believe a perch are hitting this big jointed lure though. And it's on this medium action rod. But a hungry perch will hit it. I rest my case. Uh, that wasn't so bad. He's not even a big one here. I just can't believe they'll hit that lure. Well, it seems like the perch are still here and the perch are still hungry. I mean, there's another one. I either need to take it or let it alone. One of the two. Well, so, see, and they are. That's what I mean, I know they are. They're just not always getting the hook because they're not that big. Stupid things. One out now. It's like freaking. Ooh, there's a fish. That may be a rockfish too, or else a big perch. If it's a rockfish, it's a little one. Keep forgetting this is that ultralight. Yeah, I think I got a couple little ones right here the other day. He's right up on the surface, whatever it is. It can't be a perch. A perch never come up on the surface. And he's a little one. I guess we're not going back through there for to catch another one of him. And here we go with the spaz. He was, ouch, 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 ouch. Quit it. He just a little guy. There's no wind up here to go. Oh my God. That's a nice rockfish there. I'm pretty sure that's a nice rockfish. He came up to the top already. On that chartreuse chatterbait. Oh man, is he coming right into the kayak now? Or did I lose him already? No, I still got him. That's got to be a nice one there, guys. That's got to be a nice one. I caught him on the medium action pole, too. Well, maybe they are starting to come back into this cove. Yeah, that's got to be a nice one. It's got to be at least 20, I hope. We're slowly but surely getting them in closer. Hope I got a good hook on this. Man, they always get right into the the glare on the water though, and then I can't see. I can't even really see the net them. Well, I haven't even really seen him yet. He ought to be nice though. Yeah, he is. He's nice. I just saw him. He's nice. He's got pretty probably at least 20. He's probably legal. I can just barely get him in the net. Okay. We're not gonna play around with this guy either. We're gonna try and measure him real quick. We're gonna get him back in the water. I catch these things, I'm not weighing them anymore. Whoa, look at that. Got him in just in time. 
Oh my gosh, he's big. We're gonna try and measure him real quick. We're gonna do this little maneuver that we do. Come on, fella, just let me measure you. He's not as big as I was hoping for, I guess. He's 20, a little over 21. He is a little over 21. Nice fish. We're going back through there. And he was spunky. The, oh, he may have bent my hook. This is one of them cheap hooks. These ones are these thin hooks. He bent that hook. Look at that. I can't have that happen on a 21 inch rockfish. Is that another one? Whatever it is, it's smaller. Because this is the ultralight rod. If it's a rockfish, it ain't near as big. It actually feels like a perch now. It may be a rock, though. Oh my god. It's like the baby of the one I just caught. <laughs> Seriously. They're coming back in the shallows, I guess, finally. I almost got it. There it is. Yeah, he's a cute little thing. Goodbye. Get this guy out real quick. Ah. <sighs> See, I need to quit rushing. When I rush, I screw. He's got a fish. Gosh darn it. I'm pretty sure he does. This could be another baby rock. No, that was a perch. Once again, when you stop, these perch love when it stops or slows down. They just love when it does that. We're going to keep hitting this cove. Ooh, that's a fish right there, I think. Did I lose him? Or is it a perch? I got him, whatever it is, but I think it's another perch. The perch are still back in this cove, I think. Did I lose him? So hard to tell on this medium action rod. <laughs> They're coming back into this freaking cove. Still, 62 degree water. They're still here. They're bouncing a little bit. Somehow I got into two feet of water. Yeah, that's, a, that's a fish. Good. That's a good reason to check lures. I'm guessing it's a perch, but he's fighting the whole way in, so I guess it may be another little rock. And right, now he quit fighting. That's a perch, man. Some of these perch fight. Apparently they fight more when the water gets cooler. He just a little guy too. Okay, I gotta get away from shore here. And I'll see you on the next video.